Down on Gerard Street at the heart of London's Chinatown, wax statues of Chan and fellow Kung Fu legend Bruce Lee were unveiled at Madame Tussauds, the famous wax museum that depicts all kinds of celebrities in all their waxy glory. The two statues originally appeared at the Madame Tussauds in Hong Kong and Shanghai, the birthplaces of Chan and Lee respectively, but were transported to London for the city's 2014 Chinese New Year celebration. It gave Kung Fu fans a chance to meet and greet the statues up close and take photos, although the men themselves were not present. Yes, of course, I know of Bruce Lee and Jackie Chan. We all grow up watching their movies and we love them very much indeed. Um, they are an inspiration to all martial arts, martial artists as far as I am concerned. So, yes, I've studied uh, martial arts uh, since 1977. Um, from 1990, I studied uh, Shaolin Chuan, uh, Tai Chi Chuan, Ba Gua Zhang, Xing Yi Chuan and Tong Bei Chuan. I feel really excited about this event. It's great to be a part of something so big, something that involves both England and China as well. The cultural exchange is going to be really exciting, as well as all the performances and all the fireworks, which are some of my favorite bits. Chan's statue depicts him in a casual denim cowboy look, hands on hips and a wild smile on his face. Lee's statue, meanwhile, has him donning the classic yellow jumpsuit from his film Game of Death. Each statue was worth about 150,000 British pounds and took 20 craftsmen four full months to finish each. In addition to the statues on display, a traditional Chinese lion dance was also held at the museum, rounding out a full complement of Chinese-style celebrations. The highlight of our celebrations here at Madame Tussauds London for Chinese New Year are definitely our figures of Jackie Chan and Bruce Lee, which as I said have been loaned to us from our attractions in Hong Kong and Shanghai. We're delighted that they're here and the guests are really loving getting up close and personal and taking that picture with them. So we're just delighted that we could introduce the figures for a three month period until the middle of April.